So the next credit is SS credit direct exterior access. It's a design credit. Again, it's only applicable for healthcare uh, projects. It is similar to what we have discussed, places of respite, providing a breathing space to patients and visitors. But that space was located outdoor. So a patient might be on the second floor of the building and he needs to come out to the passage and then he has to go down a circulation area, some waiting area, and finally he will reach the place of respite. So he may not want to come out again through these spaces to have a breathing space. Okay. So direct exterior access is basically providing the similar area within a close proximity. Intent is to provide patients and staff with the health benefits associated with the direct access to the natural environment. So what is the direct access? Basically, so this might be the surgical rooms or operation rooms. So providing some outdoor spaces, combine one or maybe they have separation. So you are allowing patients to go directly to these spaces. It does not have to go out the god of the space and go out of the passage and it, it don't have to go to the circulation and then finally reach the place of respite. So you have to provide a direct exterior spaces without having to leave the floor or access, access, accessing another major space. So your direct exterior space could be here also. You might have a combined terrace. Right? You may have a combined terrace for all these rooms. So that can also count towards direct exit access because it is not crossing any major space. The patient does not have to handle any other space before coming to this space. What is the amount of space you have to provide? It is 5 square feet per patient. So what amount of patient will be counted? 75% of all inpatients. So who are inpatients? The patient who are going to stay in the healthcare campus, on the hospital. Maybe undergoing surgeries, operation. So the patients who are, are going to stay in the hospital are, go, are counted as, are considered as inpatients. So 75% of such inpatient will be counted and you have to provide 5 square feet per patient of this diet exterior space. And you will also count the patients who are going to exceed their stay by 4 hours. So you might not be staying in the hospital or healthcare campus but your surgery or your treatment require uh, you will stay for a longer duration. Maybe it's a dental surgery, so it may be you may be required to be there for five six hours, just hypothetically speaking. So seventy five percent of those patients will also count toward this credit. So these numbers will be considered seventy five percent of all inpatients and seventy five percent of patients going to stay for more than four hours. And when you have this number, you have to provide the space equal to five square feet per patient. So what you have, you have to provide, this direct exterior space uh, which should be within close proximity to patient and visitors and the staff. The patient should not have to or staff does not have to go through a major space to finally come to this space. It should be immediately available. That is the requirement for direct exterior space.